Continuously Reinforced Concrete Pavement, or CRCP, is known for its long-term performance and cost-effectiveness. Recently, thick CRCP sections in Texas have shown stress points not usually seen, with segmentation of slabs at transverse cracks under the wheel paths. It appears that steel placed at mid-depth of the slab can increase warping stresses. The Texas Department of Transportation, working with Texas Tech's Center for Multidisciplinary Research in Transportation, investigated this type of distress and developed steel designs to combat the issue. Techs that used to use uh, CRCP up to what, 10 inch, 11 inch slab thickness when the traffic was not that heavy. But now, uh, due to the, I guess, increase in heavy truck traffic, Texas is using thicker slabs in their pavement up to around 15 inches. And what we found out in this research project is that when the slab is, say, up to 10 or 11 inches, uh, it works okay. Placing the steel in them at the middle depth is okay. However, when the thickness was, say, 12, 13, 14, 15 inches, yeah, placing steel at the middle depth, there are some problems. We like to consider concrete pavement as a low maintenance type of pavement. Um, and this distress was kind of eating into that idea. And so we wanted to uh, uh, have this research so that way we could improve uh, already or improve more of our concrete pavement performance than what we already have. And so uh, this was kind of the, uh, the basis for this research. So what we did was we actually uh, selected the four projects, one in Dallas district, El Paso, San Antonio, and Waco districts. So we installed various gauges in the concrete and steel in those four construction projects. Then we analyzed the data to understand the behaviors. The bulk of the research was looking at different orientations of reinforcing steel and monitoring stresses and strains in the pavement uh, as we modified uh, the steel design. And so that was the bulk of the research was done monitoring field trial sections. The major finding is that if we place steel a little bit higher than the middle depth, changes the pavement behavior substantially, and uh, then it really uh, minimizes any distresses. Right now, we have uh, drafted a revised standard uh, for uh, continuous reinforced concrete pavements that incorporate uh, the findings of this research project, uh, where we are now adjusting the location of the reinforcing steel within the slab. And so we're, 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 we're trying to push some additional research to monitor some of our other uh, concrete pavement sections so that way we could get a better understanding of those behaviors and potentially modify that steel design, uh, which could lead, again, better performance and cost savings uh, down the road. So we're, we're actively trying to push some additional research that stems directly from this research project. For more information and to find the publications for this project, please visit the Tech.Research Library at the link shown below.